Well YouTube, good evening. This is a statement I've prepared, as some of you may have noticed that my last update was somewhat of an outburst. You see, I'm a very passionate supporter of the St Kilda Football Club, and I think as many fans have been, I was distraught by the events that have occurred this week involving the players and certain photos that emerged of them. However, after my experience with Oprah, I now learn to live my best life. And that is what I choose to do now. I choose now not to stoop to the video blog games of other members of the cyber community. And while I was drawn into the defence of my team, I now take a step back. People must understand that as celebrities we have lives too. Surely some element of this life can remain the property of our family and friends, free from being plastered across the social networks. And as with the rest of the celebrity community, I offer my support to my friends involved and understand all too well what happens when a photo is leaked from your private collection. The actions of the person in question were immature and it's clearly that of someone attempting to be as amazing as us. Only a matter of months ago was footage of myself and Pierre Fitch made public, a moment that was pure chance meeting while he was in Melbourne. So I do say this, my heart goes out to the players involved and I hope this girl gets the, ch the help that she so badly needs. It's a sad reminder how badly some people would like to be like us. Surely, she could have found a more positive way to get her 15 minutes of fame. If only she had modelled herself on a more positive role model, an icon like myself. She could have emerged with an impeccable dress sense for fashion and perhaps build a funny, witty yet cheeky cabaret for the Midsummer Festival. Instead of being tossed aside on Monday with the rest of this week's news, only for people to ask tomorrow, who is she again? Stay tuned for my next update, coming live from the Vision Australia Carols by Candlelight and our hunt for Marina Pryor. This is Paparazzi, composed and filled with love. Yo, wait.